For eight years, Don Briggs has lived with celiac disease. Briggs now sticks to a gluten-free diet, avoiding foods contaminated with barley, oats, and wheat. My only symptom at that time was I lost a little bit of weight. So the doctor was kind of suspicious with me having hyperthyroid and then osteoporosis. Celiac disease damages the small intestine, and it becomes difficult for the body to absorb nutrients. To curb this, most celiacs take supplements. You can take a multivitamin. Um, you can talk to your doctor or dietitian because everybody's needs are a bit different. Some people will also need calcium and or vitamin D supplements. Folic acid you probably get from a multivitamin and just following the gluten-free diet is number one. The calcium with vitamin D and a senior's multivitamin. Lack of fiber is also an issue in gluten-free foods. A lot of the gluten-free products are low in fiber and fiber is very important for bowel health and actually lowers your risk of getting things like diverticulitis and, and cancer, colon cancer. So it is important to include fiber-rich foods where you can. So that would come from fruits and vegetables or things like quinoa, brown rice, wild rice or dried beans, canned beans. People with celiac disease can get more dietary fiber by adding amaranth, flax and quinoa in their diets. We use quinoa once in a while. I also add amaranth to my oatmeal, my gluten-free oatmeal, just to get a little fiber. And the new bread that has come out from Kinnikinix, they have a, a multi-green bread, which has more fiber. And that is one thing all celiacs have to look for was more fiber. Heinrich encourages people to contact companies if they're unsure if a product contains gluten. Because if you are getting small amounts of gluten, it doesn't allow your intestine to heal and then you won't be absorbing the nutrients you need. Avoiding gluten and taking supplements is helping Briggs. My bone scan has increased, so I'm getting, I'm getting the absorption now that I didn't. I mean, one of the things with celiac disease, especially in children, is short stature, so... I always say if I was diagnosed as a kid, I'd be six feet tall. Tammy Karachik, Shaw TV, Capital Region. Groot Derma Surgery Center's Life Matters is sponsored by Groot Derma Surgery Center. Liposuction, laser hair removal, Botox, tattoo removal. Find us online at drgroot.com or by calling 780-482-1414.